how to help someone that you love who is blind and has depression or is feeling depressed. Let's talk about it coming up. Hi guys, this is Corey from Blind Billionaire and today I want to talk about something that I think is kind of challenging. I think it's super challenging, that's why I'm making a video about it. And that is how do you help someone that you love who is blind, who has depression or is feeling depressed or feeling hopeless, feeling sad. Um, and what I want to do is discuss how I, what I'm trying and what we're trying. And also I would love to hear from you guys because you're the best resource um, to help me with this. So as you know, um, I'm married to Matt and he has blind, he's blind and he has retinitis pigmentosa. And um, like most or some people who have um, low vision or blindness, sometimes he feels depressed, um, he feels hopeless, he feels sad and frustrated and isolated um, and trapped. And as someone who loves him, who's with him, um, I want to know what the best way that I can help him is. And I wanna kind of preface this by saying that I completely understand um, what, this what this video is not about is um, like clinical depression and um, the solutions that the doctor can come up with to help people who have depression. So I think that what I want to preface this by saying is if you have depression, if you think you have depression, if you feel um, sad, hopeless, depressed, um, listless, just like not like your not like your regular self or how you used to feel, I think the best thing you can do is to talk to someone you love, talk to a medical professional, and um, do what they suggest. It might be therapy, it might be counseling, um, there's medications, there's exercise, different things you can try to help clinically. I think that is the best solution for dealing with depression is to seek out help and um, talk to medical professionals. So this video isn't, uh, this is would be like in, um, ideally in um, co uh, collaboration with those treatments, um, what can loved ones do? So this isn't about what you can do as a person who's depressed in terms of like the best medical treatment. It's about how can people who love you help you. So um, I came up with a couple of ideas on things that we have tried or that I have tried to help when Matt is feeling sad and not like himself. Um, so I think the three, and I wrote them down, <laughs> the four things that I came up with are to listen. So when he, if he feels like venting or feels like sharing his feelings, I just try and listen. I think that is helpful. Um, the other thing is to be kind. Um, just don't put more, like don't make people feel bad for sharing their feelings and for not feeling good. Um, number three is don't always offer a solution. That was something that I've struggled with um, where I wanted to come up with a solution like, oh, you don't feel like you're feeling depressed, you're feeling lonely and isolated and frustrated, like you should go to therapy, you should talk to a doctor. Um, I think that those are really important, good suggestions, but I don't, I haven't found that that's a helpful way to support him when he's feeling depressed. And then the other thing that I think is a bit controversial, but I'm going to share it anyways, is as somebody who loves somebody with you know, who feels depressed sometimes, I think it's important to not let your mood become, not let their mood become yours. So if Matt is feeling depressed or sad, I don't like run into the room like, hey, like I have the best day of my whole life. Like, you know, but I also feel like it's okay if I don't feel depressed, if he feels depressed, like don't be codependent, try and be, I can still have my feelings and he can have his, but I can still be supportive. So what I really would love to hear is how do you guys, what do you need from your loved ones when you are feeling depressed or um, frustrated, angry, um, sad? What can your loved ones do to help you? So <laughs> Matt doesn't really know I'm making this video. I'm kind of guessing. <laughs> I don't know that he'd love that I'm like bringing this up, but I want to help him. And I think if I can have you guys help me, that will be the best way um, to have this discussion. So what can your loved ones do to help you when you are not feeling your best? 
So thank you guys for watching. I really, really appreciate um, all of your support. I can't wait to hear your feedback. Thank you. Have a nice night.